Hi there, this is Umrun M6, a FIB blood pressure monitor. In this video, I will show you how to make the proper setting and how to measure your blood pressure with this BP monitor. So after unboxing, as you can see, you have to install the batteries, remove the back flip, as you can see here, and insert the batteries according to the plus and minus sign here. After installing the batteries, we have to make setting. As you can see on the screen, first as you can see this is the air, so we will set the air by pressing this left and right arrow, change the air from the default setting, as you can see we will change to 2021. To confirm the setting you have to press the back side button as you can see, press this button to confirm the setting. Now this is the month, you have to change the month, as you can see, change from default setting and then confirm again from the back side button. The same here, you have to change the date, change from the default setting and confirm the back side button to select the chosen option, as you can see here. After that, this is the time, so change the time, select your chosen time and confirm by pressing the back side button as you can see we select 4 and we confirm with the back side button now connect this tube here to the monitor as you can see here now here wrap the arm cuff accordingly to the instruction are given on the arm cuff these are the anti wrap cuff Rip above the arm cuff at least 2 cm above from the elbow as you can see in the video here and keep the tube in the middle of your arm. This device can be used by two person as you can see these are the user 1 and user 2. So before taking the BP measurement you have to select the user, user 1 or user 2 and then press the start button. As you can see the device start the blood pressure measurement and the result will be given in systolic diastolic and in the false rate on the screen as you can see it's smearing now the blood pressure this okay sign is for the arm cuff when it's okay so it means the arm cuff is wrapped properly the alert indicator in this bp monitor is different as you can see here we got the systolic diastolic and 83 so as you can see there is indicator beside the diastolic so it means the diastolic is high if the same goes for the systolic, if the BP is high, so you will see this sign also uh, parallel to the systolic. If you want to check BP for the guest, so you will press the right arrow and start button at the same time. And the blood pressure measurement will start for this patient and the data will be not saved in your monitor. As you can see this data is measured but not for user 1 or user 2 so this will not be not saved in the monitor and will not mix with your usual results as you can see here these are the result for the guest but when you press the memory button so you will not find these results let me show you further in this video press the memory button as you can see this is for the user 1 results but the guest result is not there in the monitor now let me show you how to measure the AFib with this blood pressure monitor. As you can see you will press the start button for 3 seconds and this device will start the blood pressure measurement. As you can see we will press the start button and hold for 3 seconds and the AF will appear on the screen. As you can see AF so now it will start the arterial fibrillation blood pressure measurement. So now in this if a measurement this will take three consecutive blood pressure measurement with 30 second interval this will measure bp1 bp2 and bp3 and then it will give you the arterial fibrillation result on the screen if someone has arterial fibrillation so there will a heart symbol appear on the right side of the screen which will indicate this person has arterial fibrillation if there is no arterial fibrillation uh, diagnose in the patient so there will no sign appear on the screen as you can see 
this is taking bifi measurement until now this take two bifi measurement and this will complete three this is the third one as you can see after completing the third measurement this will show the result as you can see this is the third one this all with 30 second interval and this is the result as this person he doesn't has any artery fibrillation so there is no heart symbol on the screen now i will show you the main features of this bp monitor if you want to check the memory so press this button and you will see the previous results this will be the previous result and the divided screen and this on the right side will be the latest your blood pressure measurement so this will compare the previous and the latest one if you want to check the weekly averages so press this button and as you can see this will show the averages of previous weekly results uh, in the morning and in the evening as you can see there is a sun symbol if you want to check in the evening so press it again and this will show you the weekly averages of the evening blood pressure results now let me show you how to uh, delete the memory from the device as you can see we will press the memory button and start button until uh, three dots appear on the screen as you can see here but these are blinking so we will press the same memory button and start button again until it becomes stable press and hold until it becomes stable so the memory will be deleted as you can see so the all results are deleted if you want to check so make sure again and there is no results in the monitor the same if you want to make the factory settings and go back to, back to the start setting so press the start button and this symbol of the setting button as you can see so this will go to the big factory settings press and hold until clr means clear appear on the screen as you can see but it's blinking so we will press and hold again as you can see until it becomes stable as you see so this will go back to the same date as you can see in the beginning it was 2019 so the device will be set to the factory setting if you want to know about the price of the Omron M6 blood pressure monitor, so please check the link in the description. And please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Thank you so much. Stay safe and healthy.